Hello everyone. It is William C here. Nice to meet you. I am a Cities Skylinus player from China. Special thanks to Paradox Interactive. We will launch a series of videos talking about China urban construction and development. It is my first time making a video. So for this very first episode, I am intend to try out and learn to improve my video production skills. Still hope you will like it. Any advice will be appreciated. To start, I'd like to make a quick intro of City Hondro and preparation work of making it one to one in Cities Skylines. I've been to about 175 cities around the world so far. Among the favorites are Hondro in China and Venice in Italy. Both have great scenery and deep history. Hondro is the largest estuary on the southeast coast of China, located in the center of the Yangtze River Delta, at the corner of Hondro Bay, as the capital city of Zhejiang Province. Hangzhou is famous for its West Lake which attracts 1.4140 million tourists visits annually. The place was developed as a city since Qin Dynasty 2000 years ago. In the course of history, it was the capital of Wuyue 45 dynasties and also the imperial city of Southern Song Dynasty. Currently, the population of Hangzhou is about 10 million. Its urban GDP is about $1.4 trillion which is equivalent of Greece as GDP. With a growing rate of 9% annually, the per capita GDP is $10,000. One of the most famous e-commerce company is based here, Alibaba. Hangzhou is a modern ancient oriental city. Making such a real city out in cities skylines is challenging. My principle is to build the city as real as possible while adding my own thoughts. For instance, based on my research on couple references and ancient maps, I restored the imperial palaces of the Southern Song Dynasty, which had disappeared for 800 years, including the Dichu Palace, where Song Xiaozong lived. I have been asked, how to replicate such a city in cities skylines. So I'd like to talk through the process with you guys. Step 1. I import the terrain, which is very important, including mountains, water, transportation etc. First, I searched on Google Earth for the exact terrain of the city I needed. After choosing the terrain, I go on the website of terrain, party for the selected, the 81 bars here are the 81 bars shown in the city's skylines. It can be set up either 17 or 18 since the 1 to 1 ratio in the real world is 17.26 kilometers. Click the download button on the right. Select the name of the city. Download it. Second step. Import the real traffic network of the city. Locate the city on OpenStreetMap or type in latitude and longitude if you the exact position on map. Other website like OpenStreetMap is also workable. My recommended ratio is 100 meters high, 1 to 4580. By click on the import button above, I get a 1 to 1 road network map. Afterwards, I need to add the overlay mod to the city's skylines in order to tishp the exported road map. The natural topography in cities' skylines will be completed when water is injected. Rivers and lakes are adjusted according to the actual topography. The last step is to set up the layout of the main traffic. In this way, the city is ready for citizens. Special thanks to Amamlaya, author of CSUA, for providing the layout of Hondro traffic system. I highly recommend you guys using the latest CSUA 2 for one-to-one -one construction in cities' skylines. my first cities skylines video in each of the later episodes i will take you guys a walk in hondro in my parallel world 
also welcome you guys to China, to Hongdro in the real world. Looking forward to your comments. In next video, I will take your hands with me walking along the lake, stopping by most famous scenic spot around West Lake, the Broken Bridge, where a well-known love story starts. All right, I'll see you in next episode. I'm William, a Chinese city's Skylines player. Special thanks to Paradox Interactive. I'll see you next time.